Hey guys, so you're probably like, Brittany, where the heck have you been the past few months? And I would like to start off by saying I apologize. I've had a faulty laptop and it would shut off whenever I try to edit things. And then I lost my USB cord for this camera. And so I had to record everything and put it on to an SD card to find out my laptop did not have an SD card. But the good news is I got a new laptop for Christmas and I'm pretty sure it has an SD card reader on it, so there will be videos up again. And in the holiday spirit, since yesterday was Christmas, I decided I'd show you guys what I got for Christmas as a welcome back type video. Alright, and this is me, no way, I'm not trying to brag about everything I got. Um, to be honest, I, I wasn't really in the Christmas spirit um, this year, so I wasn't all about the presents and I, I realized that it wasn't about the presents at all and but this is what I got and this is just random pulling stuff um it's a mixture between what my dad and stepmom got me and my mom and her boyfriend got me so yeah I'll start off by showing you this my older sister got me it and for all of you supernatural fans out there it's a supernatural shirt it says saving people hunting things the family business with the anti-possession symbol on it she got me and I was so excited to get it because I didn't realize at first what it was because I didn't see I haven't like I just started watching Supernatural and so I didn't know the symbol but I knew the saying and so I was like <gasps> Supernatural but yeah and then I got a bunch of socks <laughs> you guys have no idea how excited I was to get socks I just really like socks and they're really awesome so I got these they are striped and purpley and they're awesome these are the cutest socks ever, especially for Christmas time. They have little gingerbreads on them. Like, that is so cute. And I got these cute fuzzy black silvery socks. And I haven't tried them on yet, but they seem like they're really comfortable. My mama got me some socks, and she got me the more crazier colors. They're bright neon colors, as you can tell, and they have cute little designs on them. And she also got me socks and underwear, but I wasn't going to show that on the camera. I'm okay with showing my socks, just not my sock and my bras and underwear. One thing, the one really major thing, I should say, my mom got me for Christmas is a next book tablet. And it's just like this. And yeah. Guys, oh my gosh. So, I have to tell you about my newest obsession. And it is The Hobbit. And I mean, I've been obsessed with it for a while, but it's gotten kind of insane since these two goofballs in my background. My granny got me a Walmart gift card for $25. She knows how much we love our Walmart. My stepmom and dad got me an Ulta gift card for $30. They know how much I love my makeup. My stepdad got me a $25 like debit gift card but I'm not going to show you it because it has like my card stuff on it. And I got two $15 iTunes gift cards, so $30 to spend on iTunes, and this would have been very beneficial the other day when I went to go buy the Hobbit soundtracks, and it was $34. So, these two really pretty nail polishes, this one's like a purpley color, it's Sinful Colors in Let's Talk, and then this one is like a pink color, it looks orange on here, but I promise you it's not, and this is in Upside Down Thimble Berry, I think it is. Yeah. A bunch of chapstick for Christmas because I always lose my chapstick. So I got these two chapsticks and one is in raspberry cream and the other one is in green apple. Two Carmex chapsticks, which I'm still working on. One that I got, my mom got me. I got two bath and body works hand sanitizers. One is in Twisted Peppermint and the other is in Winter Candy Apple and they had the, the cutest smelling things in the world. I got this Ulta like lip gloss set thing and I'll do swatches. So this is what they look like. This one was the darker one obviously and this one was like the sheerer like pink one 
So this was the darker one and this one's the lighter one. They look like that. This is like a bright pink and this one's like a dark pink sparkle thing. So the left one is obviously the bright pink one and then the right one is like brownish color. Not brownish but like pinkish color. Here's something my daddy made me and it was it was really like it's gonna be really sentimental because it's like he made it and it's my religion as well. <laughs> so but it's this and this is everything is possible with Jesus with this Superman symbol. And I just really loved it. I almost started crying when I got it. I was like, this is the most cutest thing ever. And I just need to hang it up as soon as I get home. I was really excited about. So I asked for this for Christmas or a jersey or something like that. I don't know if you guys know, but I am a huge Vikings fan. And so I got this bad boy for Christmas. It's a Vikings shirt. And if you guys all know, number 28 is Adrian Peterson on the back. Reppin Peterson. So now I have a game day shirt and I'm super excited even though we aren't that good this year but still. This from my Nana Pops which is my stepmom's parents. And it came in this like cute little box and I don't know why but it reminded me of Harry Potter greatly and I was like whoa what is this? And I forget where they said it came from. The box came, one of the things came from Manila in the Philippines and the other came from the island in the Pacific or something like that. But inside is just this like cute little, ooh, I don't want it falling. Cute little like flowery necklace. And it looks just like that and it is so pretty. And it's, I just wanna wear it, but I'm pretty sure every time I wear jewelry, it breaks and I just don't wanna risk that. I was super excited about this though, cause I, in it was Stash Tea Collection and it was like the Christmas seasonal kind and I've already made a dent in it and I'll tell you the flavors there is pumpkin spice decaf tea which is amazing it is the yummiest thing ever there is holiday chai black tea organic merry mint green tea Christmas morning black and green tea Christmas Eve tea I should probably be showing you these and this is this is white Christmas and then this one is peppermint caffeine free herbal tea. This one is cinnamon vanilla. I'm not really a huge fan of it. I mean, it's good, but it's just not as good as I thought. And then this one is cranberry pomegranate. And I have tried pumpkin spice, Christmas Eve, Christmas morning, cinnamon vanilla. And I have a white Christmas like package in my one bag. So I've tried that as well. But I am. Um, surely going to be trying everything else and i was so excited and it's just it's like my baby i, I was so happy i kind of just there and i was like but yeah me and my teas and then i have some more stuff in this like little bag not that much more oh i got a lot of food in my stocking but i ate most of that so in my one stocking I got some chocolate and it's peanut butter and I like peanut butter and chocolate and so I was happy and I got goldfish and I don't think I, oh oh I got gummies I got gummies but I ate those I ate both of the goldfish and the gummies and then my mama got me some Mike and Ike's and I really only eat the pink ones out of this so I should, she should have just got me a bunch of pink Mike and Ike's because I would have been in Mike and Ike heaven. But that's okay. And then she gets us these every year. And every year we only eat one of them and then like leave them till next Christmas. And so we just have like a bunch of these chilling in our house. But there are these like the sweet stripe candy cane peppermint things. And please tell me I'm not the only one that get these at Christmas because I get these every year and by every year I mean every year and it's just we don't eat them and we only eat one and it just, it just go to waste because we don't eat them like I like candy canes but I don't like these type I don't know but she gets those every year and I think I might just gift it and give it to my sister because she really likes these so 
She also gets us shaving cream every year. And fun fact about my family is my sisters and I, we don't really use shaving cream. We're just like, all right, we can just use soap. And so every year she gets a shaving cream. I still have two shaving creams in my shower from last Christmas. She got me another thing of shaving cream and I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't. There's just so much shaving cream. It's just, it's insane. Like, I please tell me I'm not the only, ooh. I smudged my lip gloss, but please tell me I am not the only one who doesn't use shaving cream as much as they should. Like, yesterday morning, my sister made a joke. She was like, oh, more shaving cream. And she's like, I still have shaving cream in my shower from last Christmas. And then she was like, shows how much we shave. But it's not even just that. We just don't use shaving cream. We just use regular soap. Because, like, shaving cream, like, that makes it, that just is so tedious. And it's like... You have to like wash your hands off after so you don't like drop your razor, cut yourself, and then it's just you have to keep washing it off so you can actually shave and it's just so tedious. But she got us more shaving cream and I just I have two still in my shower and it's like can we not get Brittany shaving cream? But this is 15 minutes long, I apologize. And then the last four things I have to show. I got this Moonlight Path Bath and Body Works lotion and it came with like a shower gel but that's in my shower obviously and it smells so good. I always loved the Moonlight Path because it reminded me of old people and I just love my old people. And then see I got the White Christmas tea and that's a little package and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's ten in here but I already drank one so there's nine now. And then I got nail files because I always ask my stepmom I'm always like hey can I borrow your nail file and she's like oh yeah sure but now I have my own so I don't need to borrow hers and I kind of need them for these like little talons here and then this came on my Bath and Body Works stuff and it's a cute little elephant and it's just, I love it because elephants are cute and then the last gift I got that I cannot show you but I already told you was my laptop and it was like the laptop essentials bundle from like Best Buy. I'm pretty sure Stila Babo 9 gave one out in like the beginning of the year. So, for that, so I got that and so hopefully I can edit this video and have one up and so yeah that is what I got for Christmas and I was super excited because I just don't know what to do with all of it. <laughs> I just I need to find places to put things and I my room's already a mess so I'm just I've been leaving stuff everywhere and I'm just like I can't do this there's too much gifts and I've been leaving my tea in my room because my family would drink out of it and I don't like sharing especially my pumpkin spice tea and I just I've been leaving it in my room and I've been stepping on it every morning and it's just it's so I just need places to put things but anyway that is what I got for Christmas and I hope you all had a very Merry Christmas and if you don't celebrate Christmas I hope you had a great holiday. Merry Kwanzaa, Happy New Year, Merry Hanukkah. I don't know any other holidays besides those but yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hopefully hopefully we'll be making more and so bye. But, yeah, ooh. Sorry, people are messaging me. Anyway, I don't think I showed you this. I, like, my sister, she got this, like, we got the same size present, and my dad told her that she, he was like, don't shake it, and I was sitting there, and I was like, how come mine is allowed to be shooken, or shaken, shaken, not shooken? But I opened it, 